What's going on guys? This is Sue with Vengeance and I'm back here with another NCAA Football 14 UAB Blazers Dynasty and today Ladies and gentlemen after What I would call The biggest beatdown in NCAA history probably ever Well besides Georgia Tech versus Cumberland back in the 1900s, but whatever this is probably the second biggest beatdown in NCAA history, but I'll take it. But today, we are back at home taking on the Alabama Crimson Tide. They are one in three. They're not. They haven't been very good in recent years in this dynasty. But hey, I guess Nick Saban must have retired or something. Who knows? But if you guys are excited for today's video, make sure you guys drop a like. If you're new to the channel at all, hit that subscribe button down below. Hey, it's good for you. We just announced the other day that I uh, am doing the Cincinnati Bengals for the Madden 18 franchise. So if you guys are uh, hyped for that as well, make sure you guys check that out too if when it comes out. Uh, because I can't wait for some Madden 18. I know you guys can't either. I know I've been waiting for it. And it's been it's been pretty awesome. So right here, let's take a look at scouting. Or the, the top school lists. Yeah, we're catching up here. And we got the late visit too, so that helps us out a lot. Um, catching up here as well. Uh, we got a lead here. Uh, we're trying to push Western Michigan out of the way, out of the race. Same with Bowling Green, but I don't think we're going to have any problems with those guys. Uh, that's always a good sign. Um, depending on how many guys we get from this, this week to next week, can really determine if we want to go after Donnie Paris, which. By the looks of it, he could be very good, but we also have a lot of receivers as is. So I don't really want to, you know, add any more to the list. Um, Brian Caps, you know, he's we're catching up to him. We're catching up. We got a lead on Lonnie Wallace. Uh, we got a couple of leads here for a couple of athletes. They're actually a running back and an athlete that are both really good. Uh, so we got ourselves set up here. CJ Jones, a commit. Uh, we got almost. Um, well, it looks like they're gonna be we're gonna be recruiting in a eh, in a recruiting battle with Penn State here shortly. Uh, next week looks like uh, we're catching up here to Kerry Brown. It looks like we unlocked the door on one of them, but um, we don't get a visit. Obviously, we waited a little too long for that. Uh, Noah Newberry, we're catching up to here. We are we got a lead here. I'm not too concerned about what's gonna happen here. Uh, Todd Thomas, we got a lead here. Oh, uh, we got we to gotta push him out of the way, though. We got to keep pushing forward and make sure we get our recruits. And middle linebacker, George Davis. Uh, he's a 94% lock, uh, but we got to push Oregon State out of the way. That's not a big deal. And nobody else below him. So it looks like we're going to have another solid recruiting season. Uh, now we're going to go to the top 25. And we're going to take a look at, obviously, we're number one. I mean, with 108 points on the board, it kind of it's kind of hard to debate who's the better team here. Um, we got Texas at number two. We have uh, Miami at number three, Stanford four, Mississippi State five, Georgia Tech six, Virginia seven, Navy eight. Iowa lost their first game last week. Uh, they dropped from number two to number nine. They lost to Minnesota. Number ten is Florida. Number eleven, Penn State. Number twelve is Nebraska. 13 is TCU, 14 is Oklahoma, they lost to Texas, uh, 15 is Notre Dame, number 16, Florida State, number 17, Minnesota, number 18, Auburn, number 19, Georgia, number 20, Tennessee, BYU at 21, Colorado at 22, USC at number 23, Michigan at 24, and Ohio State number 25 at 2 and 3. So other receiving votes are going to UCLA, Central Michigan, Oregon State, Oregon, Northern Illinois, Marshall, Clemson, Tulsa, and California. And as far as the Heisman race goes, we'll take a look at that real quick here. Kenny Wright scored 10 touchdowns last game. 10. Like, 10. 10 touchdowns. Believe it or not. Uh, we got another SEC quarterback in there in the Heisman race. We got a... Um, that's, we got two SEC quarterbacks fighting for a Heisman spot. Uh, so it looks like that's gonna that might happen this year. As far as the standings go, though, uh, we're in contention here with Mississippi State. A&M is at two and two. Uh, Ole Miss three and two. Uh, Auburn at one and or three and two. LSU two and three. Arkansas three and three. 
Alabama at one and three. They might drop to one and four today. That's that's pretty sad if you're Alabama. Um, Missouri just won their first conference game. They also got Georgia and Florida right behind them. Um, one game for Missouri, and they're pretty much from going from the top to the middle of the pack. Uh, they got Tennessee. They're contending. We got Kentucky, Vanderbilt, South Alabama. They've had a pretty good season outside of, outside the conference, but inside the conference they've been kind of ba- bad. South Carolina at the bottom of the pack there at 0 and 5. They haven't had a good year. Uh, so we're going on with this game against the Alabama Crimson Tide. It should be a good one. I will see you guys on the field. And we are underway here in Legion Field as we got the we received the kickoff as always. Ike Franklin. Let's go, man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, man. That was terrible. But we got Kenny Wright here, impact player. 13-21 to 21 last game for 320 yards, four touchdown passes through the air. Let's see what he can do today. Um, Nebraska. <laughs> okay, Alabama. Oh, man. I, I, I saw Franklin. I saw Franklin five wide on third down. Are you kidding me? Dubzinski's going to wreck his face. Oh, he just got it in. Let's, make it, let's not give up that play again. No, sir. They have five wide. I'm not playing this game. Oh, get down. Oh, not today, James Wilson. Mm-mm. This might be a tough kick for him. Alabama could take the lead with this field goal. And he missed it! Let's go, man! I love it! Oh, right there. Jay Henderson. There we go. Get that offense moving, man. I am not messing around with it, man. This is this is a little bit of a, of a stalemate so far. Up for grabs! Come on, Frank! Ah. Fourth and eleven. Jesus, what is up with one first down? Really a tough spot for an offense to be in against this crowd and this stadium. Oh, not today. How do you overrun that? You just gave up 54 yards. Brennan Carter is so bad. Not fit for that role. He just gave up 54 yards on that play. And, and that's a touchdown. I knew that was a screen pass. I oh, I underplayed it. Holy smokes. Alright, we gotta get serious here. Oh, that's gone. He's gone. Uh-uh. All the way to the 30. Ooh. Let's throw him off. They can maintain the energy and the get them, get ourselves loose a little bit here. There we go. Screen pass, first down. I like it. Frank Clement, there you go. Sometimes it's the little things that matter in getting plays to work. A sense of blitz. Oh, I'll take it. Oh, I'll take it. Ben Smith, there you go. Get in the line to go for it. I don't care if I have to cheese my way into the end zone. Boop. Jacob Ingram. Touchdown. UAB. There we go, man. That's what I like to see. Let's get back up together, man. We can't have what we had last time. Carter, you got to cover your man better. Oh, fumble! Oh! Oh, my goodness! That's what I'm talking about, baby! Woo! Way to get in there, Matthew Lynch! Cedric! That's what I'm talking about, baby. 11 yards. Give me that first down. Starting in one for four. He hasn't missed a pass since that start. Whoop. Just give it to the fullback. Two-yard touchdown. There we go. 50 touchdowns already. We're only in the seventh game of the season, and we already have 50 touchdowns. That's a problem. Man coverage. Let's go. Get on him. Come on, crowd. Get up. Get up on your feet. Oh, he 
didn't get the first. Oh, that's what happens when you throw it behind the line. Bye bye. Show them what you got, baby. Show them what you got. Boop. Oh, you overbit. He bit. He bit. Uh uh. Make him pay, baby. Let's go. 39 yards. All right, we got Kenny in. Come on, Kenny. Dive. Touchdown. Let's go, man. 21 7. Let's go, man. I am not done. He saw that I read the play and he he adjusted. I'll give him credit where it's due. It's arguably the loudest Come on, D. Just like a, just like last time, baby. Oh, get sacked. Oh. Who was that? That was Keenan Brown. It's first and ten. Ball on the 40-yard line. Oh, Ben Smith. Thank you. You are so good. It's just right there at the right time. It's so beautiful. Try and Come on, Kenny. There we go. Touchdown again. Whatever it takes, man. Whatever it takes. I saw that um, the corner of the end zone was wide open, but I was like, ah, I'll just run it in. Are, you, are they just going to sit there and continue to run the ball? Oh, it's intercepted. Oh, man. Oh my and god, another turnover. This team takes advantage of opportunities, man. I, I can't I can't give this team enough credit. Kevin Smith, right place, right time. Up, oh, Frank Clement right there. Touchdown. Wide open at the right time. Kenny Smith or Kenny Wright has four touchdown passes, man. That's ridiculous. Or four touchdowns total. Defense wants to line up and man work that slant route until they stop it. Oh crap! I meant to do the big hit. I did that a little too early. Third down. Will they try and go for the? I think they're going to go for the end zone. To see him back on the sideline, and it looks like he could be returning to the game. Here comes the pressure to the end zone. Uh, no. <laughs> no. Think about it. From 37 yards away, and he gets it. Okay. 35-10. 35-10. Now they're going to run five wide. In the gun. Five wide receivers. Oh now it's on. Oh now it's on. It's on, boy. You want you want a battle? Here's a war. Oh it's on. No. Just stay down too. Just no. Just a big fat no. He's scrambling. Are you no? Get down. You gotta be kidding me with that first down. That's ridiculous. Oh, now you want to throw. Oh, that's how we're going to play. This guy's just being an all-out troll right now. Oh, thank you very much. That kind of behavior stops right here, right now. Interception, baby. It's kind of hard to tell with your inaccurate passing. Oh! Goodbye! Touchdown, Blazers! Jacob Ingram, 62 yards! To the end zone, baby! First play from scrimmage from the second half. I think we're better off stopping him on third and shorts than we are in third and longs. Well, it doesn't matter, I guess, with Alabama. Can't even complete a pass. He's not a good. He's not a good quarterback, man. He's just not. Passing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense to take a different approach here? When this quarterback is on. Oh shoot! Scoops it up. Ah, that's unfortunate. Here's something for these Please run a screen pass. What? <laughs> oh no, he's gonna be gone. That's a big six. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is he going to catch me? Is he going to catch me? No, he ain't going to catch me. Uh-uh. Touchdown pick six. 
Nah. <laughs> oh man, how did I know that was coming? It's like I know this. Third and twenty-three. You don't need to do a whole lot for that. Like. Oh, another one. You cannot do this. This should not be legal. And there's another one. Five turnovers for Alabama. Like, that should not even be fair. This isn't even fair. He's not a scrambler. We gotta take advantage of this. Oh! Intercepted. Another turnover. Six turnovers! Wants to feel bad for beating these guys so dang much, like beating up this, these teams like this. But I can't even feel bad. Oh no! Kenny Wright, no! Oh no! Touchdown again! <laughs> he just. What? <laughs> oh my god, he just broke that tackle. He said, Deuces! <laughs> Oh my God! This is just awful. We just we just turn up. We just force turnovers all day. Now he's scrambling. He's doing it again. Oh, and he fumbled again! This guy has got to be brain dead. Seven turnovers. This is not even funny. UAB with a big advantage. Touchdown again. This is just this is just nasty. This team is a juggernaut. I'm just waiting for turnover number eight. I'm just waiting for it. Oh my god again! Oh, it's another pick six. He might have a chance. Or not, but okay, I'll take it. This is not what you wanted. This is definitely not what you wanted. But you got it. If you want it, you got it. <laughs> this guy's a monster. I'm playing with fire right now. This isn't even fair. Oh my god, stop it. Stop running this play. Get it out of your playbook. Man, that was a if they run a screen pass, I swear to God. No, they're not. They don't. No team runs a screen pass out of the, out of that formation. Sacked again. Oh, right there. Tight window. Touchdown. Get Wesley some playing time. That's, that is the fun. That's the game. Oh my God! Stop this madness. Seven total touchdowns from Kenny Wright. He would have beat Alabama by themselves. The defense would have beaten Alabama by themselves. Heck, even uh, Wesley Thompson could have beaten Alabama by himself. But final score: 91 to 10. Like we're scoring just as many points as they would in a basketball game, and like. Jesus, man. If you guys enjoyed this beatdown, make sure you guys drop a like. If you're new to the channel at all, hit that subscribe button down below for more content. Till next time, my name is Sim with Vengeance. You guys have been amazing as always. I'm out. Peace.